I'm going to show you exactly how to automate your LinkedIn connections, messages, and audience growth. Now, the best part about this solution is it is extremely user-friendly, extremely affordable. I'm talking like less than a couple cups of coffee, and it is extremely effective. So let's jump into the computer screen and I will show you how you can set up your own LinkedIn automations in under 10 minutes. So the tool that we're going to be using is called Prospectin. So simply be on Google Chrome and search Chrome extensions, go to Google Chrome web store and toggle extensions here and search P-R-O-S-P-E-C-T-I-N. So like LinkedIn, but Prospectin. Search it and you will see it right here. Prospectin number one LinkedIn software. So you're gonna click this button here to add it to your Chrome extensions. I already have it added, so it's not gonna, it's gonna ask me to remove it. So you click to add it. And you should see it up here on your Chrome extensions. If you don't see it, click this little puzzle looking thing and you'll see your extensions here. Find prospect in and click to toggle the pin right here and then it will pop up. So once you have it, you can go ahead and click it and it's gonna ask you to open a LinkedIn page. So we're gonna go to a new tab. I'm going to open LinkedIn, and now that LinkedIn is open, I can go ahead and use Prospectin. So we can open a regular search tab, a Sales Navigator search tab, but you must have Sales Navigator access that you pay for to do that, which I do not, because personally, I don't need it with Prospectin. So the first thing we're going to want to do, though, is click on the CRM button right here, and this takes us to our CRM. So once it loads up, this is what it's gonna look like for you. This will all be blank um, because you don't have anything yet. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go to your campaigns. And again, I am on a pro account. Um, I'm not, I don't quite remember exactly what you can do on the free account versus the paid account, but the paid account is only like $10 a month and it's totally worth it in my opinion. So we're gonna go ahead and go to campaigns and you'll click create right here and we're gonna create a new campaign. So let's say that I want to search for videographers to sell my video strategy course. So I'm gonna name my campaign, um, actually let's name it TRDVSC, the acronym for my course, and I'll do test one YT for YouTube, I'll click okay. So now I have this campaign. So now what I'm gonna do is go back to LinkedIn click on prospecting and click open regular search tab. And what I'm going to be doing here is actually automating using prospecting. I'm going to find videographers and I'm going to have prospecting automatically send them a connection request. And when they accept that request, it's going to automatically send them a message where they can check out a free sneak peek of my course. So the first thing I wanna do, make sure people is toggled, which it is. Connections, I'm going to do second or either third plus. Let's do both of those. Show results. Locations, I'm going to do United States. And then what I'm going to do is, Prospecting is a French company, so by default it has France up here. I'm going to search video. I'm going to search videographer. So this is by job title. And you'll see that all of a sudden I see all of these people who match my search query. So these are all people who are second or third plus connections in the United States and have the job title of videographer. So now what I can do is go back to Prospectin and you're gonna see that it shows this. So I'm gonna go and select my campaign, TRDVSC test one YouTube. And whatever number you put in right here is going to be how many profiles you export from LinkedIn to your CRM. So if I put in 10, then that means that it will send automatic connection requests and if they accept messages to 10 people. You can go as many as 100, you can do 1,000, you can do whatever you want to do. For this example, I'm just going to do one because I want it to validate super quick. If you do a large number, it can take a long time to validate. So next, I'm going to go ahead and click Validate. And you can see that it is says, it says uh, profile extraction is in process. So it is extracting one profile who matches my search query from LinkedIn to my CRM. So we can see it says right here, scan 10 profiles by visiting one pages, one were successfully exported, zero were out of your network. All right, we're gonna click okay. And we can see that in this campaign, it has exported Christopher McKinney. So what I can now do is right here, I can select connect. 
I'm going to click right here to toggle everybody. And now I'm asking Prospectin to send a, send a connection to Christopher. And I want to go ahead and add a note. So what we would do is say something like, hey, Christopher, notice you're a videographer. Um, we work with videographers all around the country, and we notice that a lot of them struggle to close high-paying deals. Here's a link to our free webinar where we go over five steps to closing big deals, or here's a link where you can download two free lessons of our course where we're going to show you how to close bigger deals, etc. So what we would do is we would write that note, so we'll just put in test here, and it's going to show you what it's going to look like. Now, what I always like to do actually is start with hi and then first name, so we'll actually say hi, Christopher. Down here, it shows your own name because it's just showing you as the preview. Then we would put in our note here, and what I would click is save and send. Now, I'm not going to click that because I don't want to send this to Christopher, but if I clicked save and send, I would then see him in my queue, and it would show that he is being sent the message in my queue. So if you have like 100 people in your queue, you're going to see them all right here. Now up here, you can see how many connections you can send and how many messages you can send per day. That reminds me, this is the difference in the different paid tiers. So the free version, you have a very limited number of connections and messages you can send each day. For the paid version, I think it gives me like 100 connections and 150 messages per day, which is really nice. So you're going to see all that in your queue, and it will show it in real time that it's sending, and once your queue is empty, you're done sending. Now down here, you can see all your campaigns, you can see all of your different prospects, etc. So what you can do as well is if I went to a campaign and I wanted to send a new message to people I was already connected with, I would go here to message and I would create a campaign to send messages to people. So again, a really nice software. It's extremely affordable. Let's see if I can find uh, the pricing tiers here. Okay, so these are the pricing tiers. So the standard is free. So you have 15 connections each day. For $12.99 a month, you can do 100. So yeah, it, it's really honestly super affordable. The crazy thing is, guys, companies charge $5,000 plus per month to do this for you. And you can literally just do it yourself with Prospectin for $12.99 a month. So what's great is you can get these campaigns going. And then literally as you're sleeping, you will be sending connection requests and messages and you'll wake up to new messages, new leads, new sales, etc. whatever your goal is. So as always, I hope this video was helpful for you. If you did find it helpful, consider giving it a like and giving the channel a quick sub and we'll see you in the next video.